Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I know, I know, I know, you don't have to tell me twice, but bear! Literally everyone is playing this. I talked to my grandmother on the phone yesterday and she said to me, Sonny, we have been playing your Rebirth game and we love it. I swear to God I didn't plan on doing that and I daily apologize. But anyway, we're gonna get into this. It's the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I've already played one run just to play it because I had to. I had to. We had to do it. And I beat Mom, which felt good! It felt good to beat Mom on my first run of the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. So I've seen a couple of the new items, but still the grand majority of the game is gonna be completely new to me. So we're gonna jump into this basically blind together. Obviously Isaac is the only uh, character that we have unlocked at the moment. There's a couple new characters we can unlock as well. Uh, Lazarus is unlocked by having four or more soul hearts in a single run. Zazel unlocked by making three, three deal with the devil room. I, God, three deals with the devil in one game. I hope I'm saying that name right as well. Uh, and then, of course, Samson, Eve, Judas, Cain, Magdalene, you know, all the, all the regulars back here for our enjoyment. But let's go ahead and start our very first run together in the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Oh my God, I'm so happy it's here. It's, it's going to be fantastic. The, the run I played, it was just, uh, you know, in fact, the run that I played, the majority of the items I got, apart from maybe one or two, were all, uh, you know, more or less classic, quote-unquote, items, so... Wasn't too big of a, a spoiler-a-thon for me. We're gonna, we're gonna be pretty blind going into the majority of this year, and, uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Let's go to our first item room, see what we get. Magic Mush, alright, that's not a terrible start whatsoever. All stats upgrade. I do like the, uh, I do like the fact that the... Item pop-up now kind of gives you an idea, more or less, of what the item does. A lot of the time, it was just kind of a guessing game. You try to figure out for yourself uh, what was going on with the item that you picked up. But for a good portion of the items that I've seen now, it shows you kind of an idea of what to expect from it. So that's good. Uh, also, you probably noticed the fact that... Ooh, the tick. I'm going to go ahead and pass up on that. You probably noticed the fact that the uh, the room layouts have changed a little bit. There's actually uh, bigger rooms now. For example, this particular one right here, uh, big old horizontal room. It's no longer just the uh, the, the single square shaped rooms. There's a there's a bit of variety there now, so that's pretty nice. Oh goodness! Okay, there we go. Haven't seen too many of the uh, new enemies either, and there's also pots, which I'm not really sure what to deal with or what to do with rather. Yeah, haven't seen too many of the new enemies. I should, <laughs> I should be mindful of that. So that's gonna be a, a new treat as well. Uh, okay, yeah. Speaking of which, here we go. It's a, it's a big old poopy, and a room full of poop. How fitting. I'm gonna probably be shooting down all these poops as well. I wanna, I wanna see all that it has to offer, man. Hearts in the poop. Always the best place to find a heart. Unless you literally find your heart in your own poop, in which case I would highly recommend visiting your doctor. Whoa, that is scary. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Holy crap. This is gonna be terrible. Man, that is an ins that is an intense loadout for this stage. Oh god, yep. Whew. Alright, wasn't too wasn't too terrible. Wasn't too terrible. We got through that. Relatively unscathed. We're gonna grab another half heart down there as well. Okay. We can't grab that right now for whatever reason. I don't know why. Can we, can we pick this up? Maybe we need to kill all the enemies in the room before it allows us to take that, uh... That looks like the... looks like the 9-volt, but maybe it's not. Let's see what's going on over here. We still can't pick this up. Maybe, you know what, I bet we need to have a spacebar item in order to use that. Ooh, nice, we got the range up. You see the visual effect going on with the, uh... With the pills there as well, that's pretty interesting. By the way, speaking of visuals, looking awesome. It's got a very unique style to it, of course, it's all completely, uh... Completely redone from the from the ground up. You gotta love that. Also being brought to you in a uh, hopefully glorious 1080p 60 FPS thanks to YouTube's uh, ability to finally catch up with the rest of the modern world here and bring us those beautiful 60 frames per second now recording in that, thankfully. So hopefully you guys are enjoying that as well because it does look quite smooth. I, I really do enjoy how uh, how smooth everything looks and feels. It's quite nice. I'm gonna go ahead and grab that red heart. Alright, let's do this. First boss. Ooh, a new boss as well. Gurglings. Interesting. Oh, God, yep. And the sounds as well. So, of course, uh, we have to say uh, rip in pieces to Danny B. No longer the uh, the soundtrack master of The Binding of Isaac. That was 
Really bad dad. Bad dad damage. Bad dad damage. Dad damage. If I'm if I if I may attempt to coin a new term in episode one of Bear Plays I said episode one as well. Episode one of Bear Plays the Binding of Isaac. I guess dad damage would have to be it. We got a range up there as well. Alright, down to the next floor. Dad damage and bad damage. I mean they're basically synonymous. No offense to the to the dads out there. I don't know, I'm just basing it off of my own father, who may be watching this as well. My my dad will like will like sneak in views of my videos and then bring them up from time to time and say, "Hey, remember that time in an X situation where you where you said I was a a big dumb idiot?" And I was like, "Well, <laughs> you saw that? Oh, uh, whoops. Yeah, sorry, pop. <laughs> broken remote is broken." Okay, that's a trinket, and the uh, trinkets show up down here, by the way. I don't know if you guys, yeah, you can't see my mouse. Okay, but yeah, that's where the trinkets are down in the bottom left corner there. So that's a, that's a, that's a nice new way to, uh, to lay it out. I, I do like the layout. I like the layout of things. It's uh, a bit better as well. I'm just singing its unholy praises as much as I possibly can, of course, because it's rebirth, man. It's what we've been waiting for. It's beautiful. I do also see that tinted rock. Don't worry, I'm not gonna miss out on my first tinted rock. I may be saying that. Completely uh, unaware of the fact that I may have already missed out on a tinted rock. We'll find out, I guess, after I watch this. We got petrified poop too. I'm, I'm not gonna go ahead and use my key, my lone key for that one there. I'm gonna pass up on that. Petrified poop. I imagine maybe giving us like a chance at petrifying shots or something. Could be the case. Oh, don't wanna, don't wanna touch that. We have four bombs here now. Let's see. Oh yeah, I was talking about the sound design as well, so yeah, of course, Danny B is no longer the uh, the musical mastermind behind this one, although, of course, still is a musical mastermind in his own right. Uh, the sound design, though, as well, a lot of different sound effects, a lot of changes to the sounds the enemies produce, which is interesting. Uh, is that another Tinted Rock? Indeed it is. I think it was trying to give me a bit of a sign that that was a Tinted Rock there, by way of hiding that poop behind it. Whoa, the bombs are key. All right, so I might actually use a key here now that we've got that. Ooh, we got ourselves Bob's brain. Bob's brain gives us explosive thoughts. Interesting. That is a very interesting looking familiar. I'm not really sure what to make of it. I suppose we'll find out. Hmm. It operates similarly to Little Chub. I just don't know, really know for sure what... Okay. Alright then, is that like a one-time use thing? That'd be kind of crappy if that was only one time. Maybe it's like one time per room. That would make sense. We're getting a lot of red hearts. Oh, it's popping up again now, okay. Do we need to like destroy poop or something to have it come back? I wouldn't be surprised if that were the case either. Here's another one of those new room layouts. There are a lot of new rooms in Rebirth, man, and I'm really excited to see a whole bunch more of them as we go. We're probably gonna get to see like maybe 2% of the content through this, uh, through this first run here. Assuming we even get far enough to see that much. I suppose we'll find out. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and go inside of here. Ooh, interesting. What do we got going on here? So yeah, I guess Bob's brain does, uh, come back every so often. Magnetic tears! Strange attractors. So what are they magnetized to? I guess the metal aspects of the area. I'm gonna go through the uh, curse room here, considering how many red hearts we have strewn about the area, and no luck there, unfortunately. Let's go ahead and just get out. Uh, I'm gonna leave Rusted Key behind as well. In fact, I wanna see whether or not it shows me what that does now. It feels lucky. Petrified Poop feels lucky as well, well apparently. Not really sure why that would be. Let's go ahead and destroy this poop. Ooh, nice penny. Very good. So still quite the mystery behind uh, a good portion of the items here. Still uh, trying to figure out what exactly is going on with a lot of them. All right, monstro fight, classic monstro. Here we go. Let's see if we can use Bob's brain. Okay, so yeah, that is uh, that is something I got to be care careful of. That is gonna. Oh, the tears are bringing the enemy closer to me. That's that's interesting. That combination's not good. I know that for sure right now. Monsters 2 disappeared. Nice. A torn photo. The tears and shot upgrade. Oh, he is... He is saddened greatly by that. Weird. This is... Oh, man. Magnetic tears are very interesting. 
I don't like the combination with Bob's brain for sure already. That puts us in kind of a dangerous spot, but... That is very interesting. Okay. So we got the tears upgrade from the torn photo. Let's see what we can do here. Caves 1, let's go. And the caves have a much different look as well. I like the, uh... I like the, uh, the adjustment to the caves makes it look much more like its own area. Much more like its own place as opposed to just kind of a... a direct runoff of the, uh... of the basement. I'm gonna have to figure out how in the world I'm using this thing, man. This is interesting. That was a bad key to use. Okay, well... That's too bad. I kind of wish I could just throw the familiar at my enemies here it, instead of just trying to rely on it randomly shooting off at some point, but I suppose it's not that big of a deal. It'll eventually help us out. Grab that red heart there. Ooh, nice. Okay, that was a pretty effective use of it. These magnetic tears, man. This is going to be... I suppose in congruence with quite a few other items that I've uh, seen in the, in the regular Monday up updates over on the Rebirth blog. Could very well uh, prove to be interesting combinations that may be a lot useful to what we currently got going on. I'm going to try to get this heart to come over to me right now. Maybe if I can... Uh... Alright, that's probably close enough. There we go, nice. That is interesting. Alright, I've seen this guy before too, so he's the... Uh... He is the mobile version of the... What is that enemy called? I'm not, I'm not going to remember what the name of that one is in particular, but you guys know what I'm talking about, hopefully, if you played Isaac before. Oh, that was... Ooh, that actually worked out kind of well. It did damage to me, but that did unlock the uh, the way to get over to here. We got pheromones. Interesting. I think that might be a good one. I can't properly tell. Oh, man. Okay, so this is going to be dangerous. That's telepathy for dummies, and I guess we're going to take this. Considering we don't have the D6, of course, just yet. Ooh, okay. Oh, wow. This guy looks... Oh, his bones fire quickly. Quickly with them bones. Shit. Okay, gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Ooh. Uh, do I dare go in the shop? I don't think so. I think I'm gonna pass up on that. Chubb! Ooh, I like the new art for Chubb. That's good. Alright, so we're using telepathy for, telepathy for dummies here, which is interesting com combining the homing shot with the magnetic one. Oh, I died! Alright. <laughs> well, that didn't go so hot. Shoot. I leave all that I have. To Guppy. Damn. That was rough. Okay, not a, uh... Not a terrific combination having me... Having those magnetic tears with Bob's brain. That's something we want to avoid for the future. I gotta keep that in mind. That's unfortunate, man. We, we dropped the, uh... We dropped the magic mush. Start. That was, uh... That was a... Really solid chance for success there. But sadly, it didn't work out. I'm gonna have to... Prolong the defeat of mom a little bit longer here. Unfortunately, that scapular is basically inaccessible. That's kind of interesting. So this this is another one of those room layouts. They got the item in the middle, but it's only accessible if you can fly, which is weird. Hello. Pyromaniac. Gives me five bombs. I'm not really sure if that gave me any other benefit, though. That almost looked like Sacred Heart. I, I, I wanted to believe that we got Sacred Heart that early on. Ooh, the pink fly swarm. That's kind of scary. Probably not going to be that difficult to deal with, though. There we go. Okay. No problem there. Get a penny for our efforts. This is a big old room here. Let's see if maybe there's a tinted rock somewhere. It doesn't really look like it. There are those bomb rocks as well, by the way. So those, those are uh, what those look like. So they'll basically just create a bigger explosion if you try to utilize them. Versus Dingle. Dingle the big old poop. So I have seen Dingle before in the updates. He is, uh... He is just absolutely precious. Oh, God, he's gonna kill me, too. Holy crap. Alright, let's be a bit more careful here, I guess. Oh, God, yep. Dingle, co Dingle can take me down. Ow, oh, and so can that fly. This is not a good place for me to sit. Oh, man, wow. Come on, now. Come on, now. Let's, let's pick it up. Pick up, the pick up the play! Oh, what is going on here? Time to use some bombs, man. I gotta, I gotta be a little bit more careful. Let's see if this will kill him. Almost dead, almost dead. There we go. Oh, man. I did not want to die to Dingle. <laughs> that would have been humiliating. 
Oh, God, I wouldn't have been living that one down for quite some time. All right, we got the belt, unfortunately. I don't even know if I really want to take that, to be honest. The speed upgrade. I usually am okay with how fast we go. I'm just going to go ahead and pass on that. I will pass on the belt, which may not be the optimal play, but I'm okay with that. Basement number two. We got another large room with a, with a lot more poops again. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, man. I need to get some more damage, man. I, I took that uh, took that early magic must for granted last time with how much damage that was providing for me with the tears and damage upgrade as well as the range, speed, luck, and whatnot. It's real good. I don't think I necessarily want to go for that just yet. Probably will end up doing so. Oh, my God. There's a lot of enemies in here. Probably end up doing so in a little while, but not at this particular vector. Vector? Is that the word I'm looking for? We'll go with that. We got quite a few bombs here. I'm gonna blow up that tinted rock. I did see it right there. In fact, let's just go ahead and do that now so we can uh, maybe kill some of these flies as well. Let's grab a spirit heart here too. Holy crap, that is a lot going on in this area. Really not anything particularly dangerous. It's just gonna be a kind of a war of attrition here. Ooh, nearly got hit by him, actually. Careful! Careful, buddy! If I, if I ain't gonna die to Dingle, I'm not going down to these guys quite easily, either. Dingle's the... Dingle's the new Monstro 2, man. You shouldn't ever die to him, but sometimes he just wrecks your shit. Oh, that guy... Oh, that's interesting. Okay, so this is the, uh... the zombified fly, I guess. Weird. Oh, we got the uh, conjoined hearts there as well. All right, not a terrible room, I guess. Let's go. Uh, we'll probably go for the curse room now. Actually, we have a, a half heart laying around to wait. Although I do have spirit hearts as well, so maybe I shouldn't do that just yet. We'll hold off for now. See if maybe I lose that spirit heart to something. There's another half heart there too. Let's go on down to this this room. There's our item room. We don't have any keys, unfortunately. That's not going to happen just yet careful about this one. Probably gonna get a spirit heart from this guy. If I had to venture a guess. Careful, careful, careful. The the look and feel of things, man, I'm just I'm I'm still getting kinda used to it to be honest. It's just a a pretty drastic change. I wasn't I wasn't expecting it to feel so different, but it does. It does feel quite a bit different now. A little bit more cash. I think it may be worthwhile for us to go into that curse room now, see if maybe we get a chance at some keys or something. Another massive room. I guess these guys are going to yep. Okay, so those are pretty similar to the uh, to the red flies of yesteryear. The, the ham bones hopping about look quite a bit different as well. They're just so cute still, though. I don't think Wife Daffy likes it as much because they're, they're not as cute anymore, some of the... Some of the enemies, you, you just feel kind of terrible for them. Although the dingle is pretty adorable, let's be let's be real. The dingle is adorable. Okay, here we go up this way. Good. Good, got it. Oh, thank, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Beautiful, beautiful game. Lots of big rooms. Okay, let's go ahead and try this. There we go, that took care of that. Got another, uh, oh, got a pill out of that one, okay. There's our boss room. We definitely stand to get some more damage here. I'm gonna head over to that item room and see if we can get lucky with something good. I already have that key, of course. Let's see what this pill provides for me. Explosive diarrhea! Oh my god, whoops! <laughs> okay, wow. I'm glad I was moving for that one. I'm glad I was in a big room, too. Explosive diarrhea pill gives you just the trail of bombs, which I suppose you could try to use if you were to be, uh, be able to act upon it quickly enough. Let's go utilize that key, probably out over the curse room pretty soon here as well. Big ass rooms here, man. Ooh, white feather. Alright. Crack the sky with holy white death. I'm gonna check out this room real fast and then we'll head over to the curse room because I'm okay with losing that half spirit heart. I'm totally just fine with that. Let's blow up this tinted rock real fast. Oh, that does contain another spirit heart. Okay, so we're gonna go back for this later. Ooh, this isn't good actually. Okay, tell you what, let's just, we'll take this, we'll probably fight the boss. Assuming that maybe I'll take some damage to that boss fight and uh, that'll make the, that'll make the expenditure of the spirit hearts a lot more bearable. Ha <laughs> ha, bearable. 
Uh, another red heart. Oh my god, we had a lot of red hearts here. Speed upgrade. Okay, so I was trying to avoid that the whole time. Unfortunately, it happened anyway. Let's go fight the boss now. We've got our Crack the Sky, so hopefully we can utilize that for the boss fight. And we'll be good to go. Bada bing, bada boom, let's do it. Gurglings again. Alright, this shouldn't be too bad. These guys were pretty easy to deal with last time. Just took a little bit of... A little bit of finesse. They kind of, they're kind of like a basic enemy, to be honest. They're really not that, uh, really not that startling. It's just that there's two of them in this confined space. That's really all that really makes a huge difference. Oh, they are creating a lot more flies now, though. Okay, maybe that's gonna be, uh, maybe that's gonna be part of the problem. I shouldn't get too cocky too quickly, I guess. Taking some bad damage here. Trying to, trying to propagate that man. <laughs> Doing my damnedest. Get that hashtag trending on Twitter, huh? Oh my god, alright, yeah, I'm taking some silly damage here. I got a lot of red hearts to go pick up if that if that becomes necessary. Obviously don't want to intentionally take any damage here. These guys are both very close to dying. There we go, there goes one. I should probably try to focus on... Ooh, we got our first deal with the devil. We got a box full of stuff as well, very nice. The tower. Another no unknown pill. Oh, telepills. Alright. That's not that big of a deal. I guess we need to go over here anyway, so that's fine. Hopefully I didn't lose my deal with the devil from that, though. That would suck. That would totally blow. Let's go find out if that's indeed the case. I'm gonna grab some red hearts on my way over there as well. Please still have my deal with the devil. That would be... That would be so very sad. I didn't know those were telepills, so you can't blame me, right? You can't blame me for it. I had to experiment. Let's go find out. Oh, it's gone. Oh, that's sad. Cursed Skull as well. That's probably not a good thing to grab onto. Uh, both of those. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh well. Not the greatest result from that. Hopefully we get another chance at the deal with the devil here. That room... This floor has a clock on it for some reason. I wonder what that can mean. I wonder if that has any kind of significance. Maybe that's just an aesthetic thing. I don't know. Got another key here that's very nice. A black heart. Huh. That's interesting. Inaccessible too, unfortunately. Very strange. I wonder what that means. Hopefully we'll have the opportunity to grab that at some point. Oh, I'm really glad I got out of that situation there. A black heart, I guess that could be like a... Uh, I'm almost uh, comparing it to the, the hearts that we have seen in Choice Chamber, actually. If you guys saw us doing that. Ooh. Oh, he's pulling me toward him. Oh, okay. Interesting. So he's like an environmental hazard. That's kind of neat. Oh, God. So the black hearts are, uh, potentially, uh, some kind of effect takes place when you, when you lose it, maybe. That would be my, that would be my initial suspicion. I haven't found the item room yet. Do have a couple of keys, so we definitely want to try to get there. Got my Crack the Sky available as well. Let's go up this way. Uh, this should work. There we go. There's our curse room as well. Let's go in here first. Hmm. I'll pass on that for the time being. Okay. Well, here we go. We just got two black hearts out of nowhere. All right, then. <laughs> I suppose we'll find out what happens as a result of those. Uh, I don't want to go in there and get those locked chests just yet. I could grab that spirit heart, actually. That doesn't seem like a terrible idea. Let's go to the item room first. Item room. Oh, God. Whoa. They're on the wall. Interesting. Spiders on the wall here. Okay. Cool. That wasn't too uh, difficult to deal with. All right. What do we get? Mom's bra. All right. Classic classic and useful. Mass fear. So that one does tell you what it does. That's interesting. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and use a bomb to grab a spirit heart here. It sounds like a... A decent idea. There we go. Oh, we got a half spirit heart, half black heart. Is that what's going on up there? Very interesting. I wonder if a combination of hearts may have some kind of effect. That would be kind of neat. I suppose I'll have to find out. Let's go into our boss room and see what we get. Pin! Double trouble! Whoa! Double pin fight! Okay. Let's freeze these guys up and use a couple bombs here. See how effective that is. That was pretty good. Alright. You should probably try to focus on one pin. 
We have a double pin fight. That is... That is crazy. Oh, uh, looks like those are bombs. Okay, so we gotta be careful about that. Careful about the bomb fire. Damn. I'm glad that this is in a bigger room, too. That makes sense. That's a, that's a way for them to utilize the big rooms for the boss fights. That's cool. This is neat. Oh, they damage each other with the big bombs, too. Very good. That's helpful for me. Oh, wow. He launched himself. Holy crap. Awesome. All right. Ooh, what is this? Matchbook. Evil up. Evil is a stat. Wow. And that's an eternal heart as well. Nice. Very good. All right. Let's go ahead and head down. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep this key for the next item room here. Definitely want to preserve that. There we go. Nice. Got the eternal heart triggered. Unfortunately, can't go in here for whatever reason. My evil stat has gone up. That is... That is peculiar. Alright, Pride looks like he's about the same. Expecting a... Similar fight to those we've had in the past with this guy. This is the first, uh... This is the first of the seven sins that I've run into. Seems to be about the same. Uh, the Hermit... I believe is the shop? It is indeed. Okay, we've got seven cents. And that looks like Mom's purse, but it might not be. Fanny pack is filled with goodies. Okay. I don't know what to make of that. No, we can't do anything in this room. Oh, boy. Okay, these guys... Multiple... Multiple threats in this room here. These guys are... These guys are kind of tough to deal with. They take, a, they take a few hits and those bones fire really rapidly. Now we got Mom's bra back. Gotta try to take advantage of that. In fact, let's just go ahead and do this now. Might as well. It's a it's a pretty quick recharge. I'm not a, I'm not opposed to trying to utilize that a, uh, quite a bit more than I do. Okay, there we go. So that's what happens when we lose the black card. It triggers that. And, uh, I guess it... Oh, it does damage to all the enemies on screen. I guess it doesn't da deal damage to these guys when they're not up, of course, but... Oh, my God. I Well, all right, those are all gone now. Shit. <laughs> I really don't like this room. This is one of my least favorite rooms, and it's back, unfortunately. Oh, my God. I'm doing such dumb stuff. Whoa, wow. Okay, Fanny Pack, I guess, is, like, giving me items as soon as I get hit, which is potentially really good. Oh, man, these shots are going really fast, too. I think I got maybe a shot speed up from something. Come on, buddy. Come on, help me out. Help me out. There we go. One more. Nice. Alright, I like the black hearts. The black hearts are cool. That's very... Oh, God, this is a bad room. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Alright, let's use a bomb. We have a few. We have a few. We can, we can afford to do that. I like the uh, I like the drop of the goodies from the from the damage I'm taking. That's cool too. All right, don't want to lose on this floor again. Let's be careful. Hello, ringworm. Ooh, whoa! Nice. That's certainly an improvement over Cursed Skull. That is cool. Ringworm. I like that. We'll stick with this here. It might make it a bit difficult for this particular room. Maybe if I can get a little bit closer. Oh god, okay, yeah, this might be bad. Huh. Yeah, it's gonna start hitting the walls a lot. Let's just go ahead and lay a bomb down here, see what we can do with that. If I could get this to be, like, piercing shots or something, that would, uh, that would make my situation a lot better, but... I still like this quite a bit. It's very, very interesting. Interesting enough to keep... This is, this is what the, uh, this is, this is what the initial... Rebirth episode is going to be all about is playing with the stuff that may not otherwise be that great just out of curiosity's sake. Uh, oh man, this is going to be, um, hmm. Yeah, I'm just hitting the walls when I fire like this, so I basically have to rely on them to come through the middle area like that. There we go. Alright, this should make this a lot easier. Very good. Yeah, Ringworm is peculiar for sure. Uh, we got keys to go in here. Balls of steel, nice. And a mini mush. Speed and range up again. Oh boy. We only have one coin. I could go into the arcade and blow it up. Yeah. Oh, hello. We have Demon Baby in here. If I get some hearts from this. Yeah, one heart from that. Let's try. Oh, I probably should have blown up both of those. Ooh, two pills. We got another speed up. We have t speed up and balls of steel. Oh, nice. I've unlocked Lazarus for the four spirit hearts. Awesome. Oh, boy. I'm tempted to do this. I'm gonna try it a couple of times. 
Oh, we're getting spirit hearts as a result of the, uh... Of the, uh, fanny pack or whatever the hell we got. Nice. Alright, so I'm guessing the, uh... Hello, missing page two! We got another evil upgrade. Man, that is... Oh, whoops. Oh, god, my... Windows activation thing. Sorry. There we go. We got another, uh... We got another evil upgrade. I'm wondering what that's gonna result in. Very, very interesting. Hearts are looking good. We have a black heart now, which is good, too. Alright. Let's keep moving. We have a high priestess card. Probably gonna try to use that soon enough. So we gotta kinda stand, like, a bit to the right of the enemies if we're trying to... Hit him with our ringworm here. Or a bit to the side of them, depending on where they are. Oh boy. This this whole room is gonna be gonna be a work of art. <laughs> oh god, there's my black one. Okay, well, that took care of it. <laughs> it was like all bomb rocks as well. Holy cow. Alright, let's go fight the boss. Mega Man! Whoa! Nice! High priestess to start off with. That did quite a bit of damage. Ooh, this guy! Interesting. And he's dead. <laughs> oh, I kinda wish I had kept him alive a little bit longer. For Little Chubby has appeared in the basement now, too. Very good. Alright, what do we get here? We gotta deal with the devil. Good. We got more evil! Evil range and shot speed up. Well, shot speed up sucks, of course, but... More evil. We've become so deliciously evil through the course of this run. I wonder what's gonna happen there. Pheromones and more balls of steel. Nice. Oh, okay, so the spirit art's going off to the right of the, uh, the black heart. That's cool. So let's go ahead and for sure get the mark for the damage upgrade. I kind of want to go Guppy's Paw. I'm going to go... Let's go with that. I'll take one red heart with me. Ooh, I kind of wish I hadn't, though. Kind of would have been cool to go all spirit hearts here, but let's go, uh... Let's go out with a bang, nonetheless. Still another floor to go before we get to mom. Let's push forward into the depths. We've become very, very evil here. I think I can actually hit this guy without uh, destroying the poops. He's a very, a very angry poop. A very angry poop. Oh, I can get hit by those guys. Shoot, I gotta be careful. I'm starting to not like ringworm anymore. I'm starting to kind of be sad that I picked that up. I need to be dealing a lot more damage here. This guy is just not even, not even having it. Oh, I'm hitting the, uh, I'm hitting the skulls here. Okay, so let's try to, let's try to bomb this guy away. Turn into little lower ones. There we go. I think the shot speed up actually affects how fast those guys move. Wow, that totally sucks if that's the case. I need to deal so much more damage, man. Not happy. Not happy with the damage right now. Luck down. Oh, that's not good. That's kind of a bummer. Re Revel in the power of darkness. I wonder if this devil card would be like enough to send me over the edge as far as evil is concerned. Maybe this will be the difference maker. That's an evil starfish. Huh. Pentagram! Oh, nice! Am I... I'm looking really, really evil right now. Huh. This is peculiar. If I could get a few more tier effect items, I, I think that the ringworm might work out okay, but as it stands right now, it just kind of is not helping me out very much. I could use some more bombs as well. The fanny pack is hopefully helping me out like that. Alright, so yeah, if I stand like kind of to the side of them, I'm just going to use some bombs. Oh, that's not working. Oh, nice. Tinted rock. That should be two. There we go. Alright. Fortunately, Andy, you uh, had to do that the cheapskate way. Oh, this is an interesting enemy. Hello there, friend. Okay, we got ourselves... I'm gonna take that! Spider bite for the slow effect. I'm gonna take that. I think that's worthwhile. My shot speed, man, is crazy right now. That's... That may be a contributing factor in how difficult it is to actually hit enemies right now. There's the... Oh, so you can actually see the slow effect take place in the enemies now, too. That's kinda neat. If I could get something like my reflection, my reflection might actually be a difference maker here too. A whole bunch of there's a whole bunch of shot effect items that I'd very much like to see or get the chance at seeing here. 
I'm running low on bombs, so I should probably try to, uh, try to conserve them a little bit. It's very, very difficult to hit these guys, unfortunately. Oh, man. Tell you what, I'm gonna go for another one here. There goes one more. I've got two bombs for both of these guys. If I could just avoid, like, fighting these enemies. Alright, we got him. Oh, this is gonna be... There we go, nice. Alright, not too bad. Got another bomb out of our... Out of our troubles there. Oh, hello there. Hello, friend. My old nemesis, Blue Worm. I've never met you before, but damn it, do we have a storied history. Whoa, what is... The, whoa, good lord. Mom's hand? Where did that come from? Holy shit. Okay, let's go to the item room. Uh, Epicac? Chemical peel. Oh, damn. I got excited. <laughs> okay, uh, do I want to go in here? I, I have a few keys I could probably... Oh, the blue fly. Oh, I really want that. I, I need six cents. And I actually might want to take a bunch of damage considering the fanny pack is giving me coins on occasion. So maybe... Maybe I ought to try for that so I can get that blue fly, whatever that does for me. I'm curious enough to try to find out one way or another. Let's see if I just maybe get six sets organically here. That could very well happen as well. I got a damage upgrade by way of the chemical peel, so that's good. That's every other shot I think is going to be the red one. So hopefully we can utilize that. This guy's... Oh my god. <laughs> oh, nice! There's five. Alright, one more penny. One more penny will do the job for me here. How in the world am I going to hit this poop? That kind of worked. Okay. Uh, can I get to it? Nope. Come on. Come on. I just want to see if you got a penny. Nope. Okay. Oh, wow. They've got... Oh, they're wearing masks. They're like Cubone! And Mar Marowak? That's the one, right? I remember Pokemon. Interesting. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, so that was a nice little uh, strategy that we employed there. of Way to deal with that guy. I'm gonna shake away my falling asleep hand on the desk here. Sorry. Still have my devil card. Still trying to get for that last penny to be able to get that blue fly. Let's see what else we can find here. Ooh, here's the danger. Okay. Uh, I could certainly try to go for these, but he's making it pretty difficult. Explosive diarrhea back again. Uh, no thank you. Okay, this way. Haven't done this one yet. Health up. Nice. That's very good. Uh, and then we've got a bomb over here, which is probably worthwhile. And then I think that's a balls of steel. That is a balls of steel. Very good. Okay. Nice. Handled that pretty well. Holy crap! Whoa! Brimstone spiders. Odd. Well, that's a threat. My goodness. There's our final penny. Nice. Alright, definitely gonna go get that, uh... That blue spider item, whatever the hell that is. Oh, I totally forgot I have Mom's Brow, too. I haven't been using that at all. My bad. My bad for the failure to use the spacebar items. Might be getting a new one here, so uh, yeah, might as well use this now. Oh, that's a that's a beautiful visual that we get to see up close and personal now. That didn't work very well at all, unfortunately. Come on now, buddy. Let me finish you off, nice and easy. All right, definitely gonna go for that item before we head up the uh, the boss fight here. Let's see, uh, there isn't also another really big room that I want to check out down this way. Ooh, maybe I didn't want to go in here. This is not. This is not ideal. So you take care of him. Oh god. Terrible damage. Dad damage. Dad damage. Damn it! Damn it, Dad! There we go. Ah! Still more rooms. Holy crap. I'm gonna go for this. I think it's probably worthwhile. Bomb and a key. See what's inside. Two bombs. Alright. A terrible trade off for the current situation. Heading back over, that is not the way to the shop. That is uh, over here, I want to say. Got another red heart as well. Did we check this out yet? We did, okay, yeah. I think we got the... What did we get out of that? Oh, we got the slow effect, that's right. Alright, what did we get? Hive mind, giant spiders and flies. Huh. Okay. Giant spiders and flies, is that... That seems like it's a bad thing. But maybe that only refers to the spiders and flies that we generate? That could be the case. What are those munchers? I think... Oh, okay, so those guys die after you kill the other enemies. Nice. 
All right, I think this is the last room on this floor. I'm gonna go ahead and ooh, these ghosts following me around. Spoopy, spoopy ghosts. I should have saved that for the boss fight. Oh well. Oh well. Another key. Very good. All right, let's get moving. I think it's time to fight the boss. Gonna lose out on some. Uh, yeah, that was a speed up pill, and yeah, that pill is something else I definitely don't want. All right, here we go. The gate. Whoa, dude, that one looks awesome. Very interesting. Whoa, shit! Nice fire effect. Oh god, okay. There's my there's my doom heart. I'm gonna try to stay where I can hit this guy. That's not gonna hit me. Nice. I don't think I necessarily want to use my devil card here. Getting another red heart, that's not going to help me out. Ooh, I'm taking a lot of damage. i got to be more careful. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. That was interesting. This is like a tougher Gertie fight almost. Okay, cool. Get him. Come on, get him. There we go. Ooh, what do we get? Magic scab. Health and luck upgrade. Okay, cool. That was good. Down to mom. Wow. Oh man, here we go. Here we go, down to the depths too. Let's do this, baby. Almost have Mom's bra again. So yeah, here's a normal room with the, uh... The Giblets? Is that what they were called? Giblets sounds cute enough to be their name. Let's let's go with that. <laughs> Until we see them again. There's our good old pal Larry Jr. here as well. I'm, I'm still hoping that we can find something to utilize uh, better with the uh, the ringworm here. Fortunately, not having a ton of luck in that regard. More bombs, good. Okay. Moving on along, we still have plenty of keys. Gonna be able to unlock this item room as soon as we can find it. Ooh, I don't like this room too much. Pretty familiar sight. Moving spike platforms. How do we, uh... There we go. Nice. Not gonna get in there, unfortunately. Still have my mom's bra proc ready to go. Oh my god, careful about that. That brimstone lasts for quite some time, actually. Gotta be... Gotta be weary. Hello. Cartridge. I remember these. Alright, so that gets us our normal tears back. I'm gonna go ahead and not pick up the ringworm again. I wonder what the cartridge does. Do I need to, like, blow in it? I'll just blow in the microphone. Maybe that'll do the job. I triggered something, right? Kills all the enemies on the screen. Almost certainly. Sorry for... Seductively blowing at you, viewers. <laughs> uh, oh, I think I missed out. Oh, God, whoops. That was bad. I, I was gonna say I think I missed out in the other room. Oh, God. But I'm pretty sure I didn't. I think that's just uh, showing you that there's a trinket or something in that area. Let's pass on that. There's our boss fight. Oh, this is... Alright, you know what? Here you go. Here you go. Save us some time. Didn't do as much good as I wanted it to, but still had a pretty good effect. Alright, definitely want to try to get to the uh, the last item room here before we head into the mom fight. Give us as many advantages as possible. This is going to be a pretty easy room here as well. Good, okay. Still so far so good. I think I'm in a pretty good spot to kill mom, but it certainly use a few more upgrades if I can find them. Oh god. Uh, let's go this way. There it is, nice. I love these big stompy guys, man. I, I'm not happy. I have a lot of intestinal issues and mama left me down here to sort them out myself. Pyro! Oh snap. Alright. And the butter bean has appeared in the basement. Okay. Not really sure what that had to do with, but I'm happy with it. Uh, we might just kind of pass the rest of this floor. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Oh god, that was terrible. We dropped a live bomb from that damage. That was interesting. Down to our base three hearts. I suppose I might as well check this out. Oh, okay, agreed fight. Yeah, that, that should have made sense, I guess. Careful of the shot speed here. Gotta try to proc that slow effect one more time if I can grab it. I probably should have used a, uh, a bomb, but oh well. There we are. Steam sale is back in action. Okay. I think we're ready. 
Let's go fight mom. We got our devil card to use as well. I'm not really sure if that's gonna give me a huge effect, but let's find out. I'm gonna use a bunch of bombs here. Probably just gonna lay bombs the entire time, let's be real. <laughs> just constantly dropping bombs everywhere. Try to use them effectively if, I, if at all possible, but I would be remiss if I let 90 bombs go to the wayside because I was trying to be too careful. Uh, in fact, I might just try to lay them on the, on the sides here in the off chance that the mom parts spawn in those areas. That's probably in my best interest. Oh god, okay, I'm taking some taking some damage here, gotta be careful. Gonna lay that there, gonna lay this here. If I leave one enemy alive, does she just not spawn as much? Is that what's going on here? Oh, snap. Ooh, nice spirit heart drop. That's helpful. Taking some damage, taking some damage, gotta be careful, grab another spirit heart lost. Oh god. I'm not sure what procced when that happened. Oh, it's gonna go again. Nice! Whoa! We got it! His mother, fueled with the desire to serve her god, was bearing down on Isaac. I will do as I am told, my lord. I love you above all else, Isaac's mother repeated to herself. This was the end of the line for Isaac. His mother was far too strong for him. But just as he accepted his fate, God intervened, sending an angel down from above to stop his mother's hand. And just like that, it was over. Ooh! Fancy new animation, too. There we go. Alright, so that is... That's it for the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. No, I'm just kidding. That's, <laughs> that's episode one. We've managed to defeat Mom in episode one, and we'll be back with plenty more Rebirth on the way here, guys. So feel free to subscribe if you're interested in that. If you're new here, or of course, just stick around for more of that content if you've been here from before. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.